Hey guys, welcome back to Love and Junk. I'm Laura. I'm John. And today we have a little quick uh, new product that we found. Have you seen this one yet? Fruity Pebbles candy bar. I I am I can't wait to try this. When I was a kid, Fruity Pebbles was my favorite cereal. I don't think we've ever talked about this, you and I. True confessions. I wanted to love Fruity Pebbles. I mean... The only thing I didn't like, you have to eat it really quick or else it gets soggy. Is that what your complaint was going to be? No. Oh. Well, kind of. I mean, I wasn't the biggest... I liked it okay. It just wasn't one of my favorites. But I wanted it to be my favorite because the Flintstones yeah. were my absolute favorite. And so I wanted it to be my favorite cereal, and I wanted to live off of it. And I would try it, and it was okay, but it wasn't no Lucky Charms, if you know what I mean. Yeah, it was better than Lucky Charms. Because <laughs> it didn't have that gross <laughs> marshmallows in it. Although, now you can get Fruity Pebbles with marshmallows. Uh, I'm sure you can. We should give that a try. We haven't tried it yet. No. Nope. So anyway. This is by Frankford. And tell you what, they've got it going on lately i mm -hmm. mean i've been seeing um, them everywhere first time i really saw any of their products was around easter time because they always come out with the bunnies uh, chocolate bunnies and stuff like that but mm -hmm. um we recently did the uh, a green version of the hocus pocus buns you should check out that video but that also was a frankfurt product so that yeah was cool. those they were sour apple marshmallows yeah but anyway back to the product at hand we found ours at Walmart. Yeah. There weren't other ones. It was just a random. It's not like they came out. I mean, maybe they did. And if they did, you let us know in the comments. Uh, it's not like they came out with a whole line of cereal candy bars. It was just this by itself by the checkout. Yeah. Wasn't in the candy section because we had been there too uh, by the checkouts. There they sat and not in all of the checkouts. Right. Um, Gotta look for it. Yep. So, and it only came in king size. So it looks like white chocolate with fruity, fruity pebbles, pebbles. <laughs> yeah. right can i try shot. it yeah neither one of us love white chocolate i, I feel like every to say that. <laughs> i feel like every time we get on here it's like here's a list of what we don't like meanwhile yeah. <laughs> we have a food youtube channel there's a lot of things we like oh it smells really good I think kids would absolutely love this. Ooh. Or if you love Fruity Pebbles, I think it does. Really love it smells this, like Fruity Pebbles for sure. I wonder why it smells like Fruity Pebbles. Uh oh. I wonder. Thank you. I mean, I don't despise white chocolate. Just if you ask me white or chocolate, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. I, I want chocolate, chocolate. Cheers. Cheers. Mmm. Mmm. As far as white chocolate stuff goes, I don't mind it. Oh, that's pretty good. Mm-hmm. I like the little crunchy bits of the cereal in there. It gives me Nestle Crunch vibes, as mm -hmm. far as that's concerned. The texture is yeah. like that, but obviously white chocolate and Fruity Pebbles, if you can imagine. Um, that's worth picking up. I don't remember how much it was. A dollar something, a dollar fifty nine or a dollar seventy nine or something like that. Less than two bucks, more than a dollar. Wow, that's good. Mm hmm. I like that. I, I couldn't sit and eat a whole big thing. But they're, you know, broken into squares. I, yeah, I mean, I could eat a square of it and then come back. I mean, we say that like that is a bad thing, but I mean, that's actually a good thing. Yeah. It's like a, a Nestle's Crunch, though. I love to do Nestle's Crunch frozen in the freezer. I think that would be good in the freezer. Mm hmm. So. Yeah. That mm -hmm. is worth a pickup. And it's different. And if you have somebody that loves wow. fruity pebbles in your life, that's worth picking up. And it's so strange because normally we're not white chocolate people. Yeah. But that fruity pebbles, it's the texture and, and the, the fruity. Yeah. Yeah. That's probably, to be honest with you, my favorite white chocolate thing I've probably ever mm -hmm. had. Wow. I could be lying. There could be something in an international box that we got before that was really different. I really like nuts with white chocolate but now i have a nut allergy so i can't really eat that but i think like peanuts you know like nut clusters that yeah. have white chocolate right. i think that tastes really good together that's good and uh, and speaking of nuts i often miss crunch yeah in candy, candy because bar. i can't yeah. have nuts so that kind of gives me the same kind of right texture that i 
sometimes miss. I like her. Me too. <laughs> well, we'll share. Uh, so anyway, if you are new here, hello and welcome. This is what we do. We try food and we tell you whether or not you should pick it up. Now, that's worth picking up. It is worth picking up. And I'm not sure. It doesn't say anywhere on here that it's a limited time or anything like that. Mm-mm. Or a limited edition or anything. So hopefully you'll be able to get it. Yeah. If you are not subscribed, go ahead and do that right now. Yeah. You're going to want to. You're not going to want to miss out all the things that we have planned for the upcoming holidays. Lots of stuff. We are daily uh, putting videos out at yeah. this point. We're going to hope to continue that for as long as we can. And uh, when you're subscribing, make sure you hit the little bell Ding. so you can be notified when our next video does go out. Now, we are also on Pinterest. We're on Twitter. We're on Facebook. TikTok. Find us at all those places, too, and we can chat. You can see what else we're doing. Sometimes you get a little sneak preview of videos that we're coming out. You see pictures of our dinner. Yeah. Our cat. You know. Artwork. <laughs> Other stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, now, if you like Fruity Pebbles, which I feel like most of the world does... Fruity Pebbles are a thing. It, right? Fruity <laughs> Pebbles are a thing. We talked about this in a recent video, how mm, we just recently tried cereal ice cream. If you haven't seen that, maybe we'll do a little link right mm-hmm. here. Um, it was Lucky Charms and Cinnamon Toast Crunch. I think Fruity Pebbles would be really good on ice cream, too. Oh, yeah. Yeah. But cereal in things or on top of things is a real trend. And you see, uh, you walk into any donut shop and you can find Fruity Pebbles on a donut now. Yeah, Fruity so Pebbles donut. Yeah, it was popular sure. when we were kids, and then all of a sudden, it's popular again within yeah. the last couple of years, which is kind of cool. Which, you know, like kids these days don't even know what the Flintstones are. So. <laughs> wow. You just said kids these days. Kids these days. Just <laughs> don't, darn whippersnappers. Anyway, if you like Fruity Pebbles or candy bars or trying new things or old people or hey. us or the video, then give this video a big thumbs up. And that is all we have for today. That's it, guys. Time for John's Metamucil. Bye now. (laughs) Bye.